20 years ago, the world fell to shit. Cities put up walls to protect themselves and threw the criminals out so they could fight over what was left. But there are humble motherfuckers like me delivering cargo from one walled city to another. And that's where the cars and guns come in. It's cool. I like this trailer. Cool. So if I'm here, then the exit is... Oh, they have a footlocker. Oh, son of a... That's pretty good. I like it. Welcome to New San Francisco. I want to hire you. Pick up a package. Bring it back. I can make your every wish come true. So, John, what do you wish for? Toilet paper. Two ply. I think I can do better. Three ply? <laughs> All right, it's good. I like this. This package. It's fun. It's rude not to introduce yourself before pulling a gun on someone. Oh, it's rude. <laughs> if you put the Come gun down, now. I'll drop you off as close as I can to where you're going. She's quiet. She don't talk. Motherfucker, eat shit. Much. You have no idea what's out east. Even the people trying to bring the law back are dangerous. This is our land. These are our roads. And they're gonna have to go through Vegas. We both know who rules Vegas, John. Hi, everybody. Whoa. Nice. Oh, come, come on. That's cool. As good as that. <laughs> I got to go back and hear what he says. It's a good trailer. I like it. What do you say? And never, everybody. <laughs> I've never seen anyone cut off a human head and catch it as okay. good as that. <laughs> come on now. This is going to be fun. Peekaboo. <laughs> Hey, that was uh, that was uh, 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 my favorite car. That was Mortimer. That was uh, 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 Shadow, and then that was Amanda Watts. Look at that. That's cool. I've never seen anyone cut off a human head. Well, they got cursing and blood. That's good. This is gonna be fun. Peek-a-boo. Check that shit out. Look at that. That's that. Look at that. I mean, it's CG up the butthole, but damn. Look at that. That's a uh, fucking shadow, bitches. That's Amanda Watts. This never happened to me before. Really? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, my God. It's DMV. What's down the red line? No, oh, please. Cool. Screams. Come on now. I want, I, I want to see that car come back to again. This is gonna be fun. Peek-a-boo. Look at that. Oh, it's cool. This never happened to me before. Really? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh my god, it's DMV. What's down the red line? No, please! <laughs> um, I'll tell you what, without giving away too much, I can tell you that uh, not everybody that are the powers that be were happy with the first trailer. Now, I don't know if the show's going to be any good. I'm still, you know, jury's out on that. Uh, but as I said in the last video, I think that the pedigree of the folks working on the show is, is really great. And that's a good fucking trailer. If that was the trailer that they showed at Keeley's thing, I think they would have been, and I guess it wasn't ready, they would have been in a much better place in terms of people's interest. Now, again, I'm not saying this looks like, you know, an Emmy winning fucking show or even a over the top best action ever in a TV show. It just looks... You know, it looks uh, it looks fun. It looks dumb, fun, violent. Um, it looks like a fucking good midnight movie. I'm in. I'm in. If it doesn't live up to that, I'll fucking be the first to tell you or the second to tell you. But I'm oh, sorry, Ricardo. What did you think of the trailer? I really loved it. I had no interest in, in the show and what I've seen. I really liked it. Yeah, me too. And I think Mackie, Mackie is really good at, in it. At the moment, really everything like what we've seen there uh, is really funny. He's, he seems really chill in it. I, I dug it. I dug yeah. it. Um, Ravnos does not like it. He says, uh, I don't know what he doesn't like about it. He says, would you like to hear a dissenting opinion? Yeah, I don't care. What do you think? I mean, I'm sure you hate it because you hate everything. You're like that kid in the Life cereal commercial. But that said, 
Uh, yes, Ravnos, what do you, what do you, uh, oh my, you don't even like, what? Okay, he's literally in the chat now shitting on Wolverine's yellow outfit. Have you guys, you guys have seen Wolverine's yellow outfit with Deadpool today with Hugh Jackman? Come on. That's cool, man. That thing's fucking cool. Uh, no, Little Mikey did not die from Pop Rocks. That's the, that's the, uh, uh rumor. A fun R-rated silly action show, says Ricardo. I, I, it's exactly what, what, what else would you like it to be? I know there are some people that are hoping it would take a hard R horror take. And I still think that would be great to see them do with the, the license one day. But that obviously isn't this. In a lot of ways, this feels a lot more like the first Twisted Metal. Uh, it's a little goofy, but I'm down. I'm totally down. Awesome says, just give us the vehicle combat, not the human characters. The Godzilla movies couldn't get it right. Yeah, but the problem with that is that, look, you're not going to hang a TV show on just car combat unless it's like WWE, even WWE. If you, you know, I remember going to my agent at uh, William Morris at the time or Endeavor, wherever he was at the time. And they said, what would you like to do? And I said, um, I'd really love to do a God of War musical. Uh, with Jim Steinman as the, you know, one of the key creators. If you don't know who it is, look him up. And I said, I would love to do a Twisted Metal arena stunt show like WWE meets kind of like off-road racing inside arenas and have all the characters and travel around the country and the world with pyrotechnics and stunts and the characters having bits and stuff. Those are the two things that I really wanted to do uh, at some point when I was just leaving Sony, but obviously none, none of those ever happened. So to me, I'd love to see a show like that, but short of that, I think you got to have the characters. You've got to have, you know, people vibing with, uh, more than just the car combat. Cause I think that's going to get kind of stale. That's all you see. Anyway, there you go. I, I, I really liked it. I'm excited to call the Sony folks uh, after the stream today and tell them I'm like, Hey, that was good. You guys, let me, let me check this email. In fact, I just got an email from them. Uh, let me see if that is them offering to send me a screener because I, I so appreciate them uh, offering me to go to L.A. to uh, to watch it. But I don't want to go to L.A. Yeah, they want me to come to the lot. I don't want to come to the lot. I want you guys to send me a code, man. I just want to sit on my ass. Uh, like a screener, like a an early view of it, right? Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's talk about tomorrow's show for a little bit. Uh, you know, news is... I'm sorry, Jeffy. Yeah. If you're not going to LA, how the hell are you coming to Portugal? Well, my assumption is that the only reason I would ever come to Portugal is because the show is doing so well that I won't feel guilty about spending the money I need to spend to enjoy traveling. Right? So I don't, if, if somebody were to say, hey man, we will uh, send a car for you. You know, or Portugal, you can you can afford to fly first class and not feel guilty about it. And, you know, to me, it's not that I don't really want to be in L.A. or that I don't want to be in Portugal. Uh, I don't want to get there. It's the getting there that makes me absolutely bored out of my fucking mind. It's the waiting in line and the security and the customs and the flying and the jet lag. It's just fuck you. I don't want to do it. Um, but if that's it, why there's a switch, no, no, I just don't have, I don't have any interest in, and in, I, I did so much that already I've done the flying around guy thing. Rocker Matt says, I don't like I how they removed the supernatural aspect with Calypso. Um, Nev Campbell is credited as Raven and Calypso. Well, I know some things, uh, but I certainly won't tell you what they are. Uh, one of those things is not whether the supernatural thing has been removed or not that I don't know, but I definitely think let, let's just say, I don't want to say, I can't say anything. I won't say anything. I won't do it, but let's just say that um, your comment is interesting. <laughs> so there you go. All right. Let's talk about tomorrow's show.